bravery, honor, and courage are what the United States Marines are known for. But when many Marines like Lance Corporal Derek Waldron come home injured, they're often forgotten. I'm in this ward called the Patriot Inn, and I'm the only one there, and it's just really boring, just sitting there all alone. Waldron was serving with a tank crew when his foot accidentally got caught in a moving turret. When my, my foot got caught in the tank, it like popped, and there's a really big open wound on the bottom of my foot. I broke my uh, big toe, my ankle, and I got about six screws in there. Other wounded soldiers, like Corporal Keith Barnes, haven't been out of the hospital for months. We got ambushed in Fallujah, and uh, my truck got hit with an RPG, which threw me against the truck and like knocked me unconscious for a little while. And ever since, I've been having these bad problems with my, you know, my head. Recently, Operation Blessing got together with the Wounded Marine Program, a nonprofit group that reaches out to active duty and wounded vets. We put together a little overnight fishing trip for Derek, Keith, and seven other guys, giving them some much needed time away from the hospital. For them to be able to get out and enjoy nature uh, with each other and hang out, it's just, it's a real treat for us to see their face and um, be able to catch some big fish and have a good time. Uh, it, it means a lot to them, it really does. It's not often I get to catch a 27 pound catfish. We were pulling against the current and it's a 27 pound fish, so uh, it was a little bit of a fight. It means a lot. I got to get out of the hospital for one on a beautiful, relaxing day. Got to do some fishing, so. It get a little stressful just being in one place all the time. It's good to get away. Because of the support of CBN partners, Operation Blessing is able to bring a little joy into the lives of those who have served so faithfully. Operation Blessing has always been there for us uh, when we've needed to do something. It means a lot, you know, it shows that people care. A lot of guys that's in my unit feel like, you know, they're down on the last leg. Then we have things like this that make us, you know, feel good.